Hey you guys, this is take three of this video. Um, let's try this again. Welcome back to my channel. Fabulously Charlie here. Um, as you can see in the background, I've got a wig or two. Um, we'll get into that. I know I said the last video we were going to get into what I've been doing um, and what's been going on with me. Um, as you can see, I'm rocking a new do from my last video. Um, long story short, I'm losing my hair. Um, don't know what's causing it. So when I went to the doctor and I just got my results back via email, um, this particular doctor said for me to stop one of my medications to see where that puts me. Um, we're going to stop this medication for about two months. Um, I was recommended to up one of my supplements and try that and see where we're going to be. So as you can see, rocking some short hair, which I love my short hair. Um, granted, I wish, <laughs> I wish I still had my long hair. Um, I know you guys are like, oh, but your hair still looks so full and so thick, but it's not. I have thin spots. I have a few bald spots in the back. Um, obviously, I have put product in my hair to make it look full. I have been using a shampoo and a conditioner to add volume into my hair. So that is why my hair looks the way it does. I have put product in it and it looks really fabulous because of the product. I have been wearing a wig today, so it's kind of flat, but it's kind of not because I can kind of rock. That's the great thing about having this short hair. I can kind of rock my hair out a little bit and it, the texture comes back out, the curl comes back out. Um, it looks really good no matter what I do. Uh, to it afterwards but I can feel a difference in my hair you guys might not be able to see it I'm not gonna get into the nitty-gritty details of my hair being so thin and that must be my son coming home so I'm gonna show you there's some wigs back there um, right there and I got a couple over there and yeah I've been rocking some wigs and he's calling me um, I'm videoing What's the problem? I didn't drive here. Why didn't you drive here? Truck died. Okay. And we have a dead truck. So, as you can see, short hair. And I'm videoing, so give me a minute. Um, but that is not why I'm making this video. Yes. I'm videoing. Are you going to say hi? No. But you're going to be on the video and talk. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just telling you what's wrong. Uh, what happened to the truck? So I was in Judge's neighborhood up uh -huh. the street. Uh, and I made it, I guess you can say that we're friends, but it's, he's an older dude. Um, and he has a lot of nice cars. Mm -hmm. uh, and so has, how uh, did you get home? Uh, well, Georgia had to go home. And uh, I was talking to him about how I want to try to get a, C, a Chevy C10. Uh, Poor Coda. And I was One of the about, dogs hit his head on the on the desk. Okay. So I, I told him uh, that, that I'm not really planning to keep the the Ranger and what's wrong with it, what's been mm -hmm. going on the past two days. And right after we got done talking, I was saying that I had to go, da 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 da. And he's already back up in his garage. I go to start the truck. And it didn't start. No. So then we try to jump it off. Uh, and he knows a whole lot more about vehicles than I do, mm -hmm. so he figured out what was wrong, which is what I, I was hoping that was, rather than being a bad alternator. He which explained is... what would be wrong, how I would know what's wrong with the alternator, and it's just a battery shot. I need to get a new battery. So Your dad's it's... supposed to be getting that, I think, today, so you need to call him, let him know. So what do we need to do about the truck? Well, they got cameras in the neighborhood. There's a cop that lives in the neighborhood, and it's it's locked. I have a key that opens up the door, mm -hmm. so it's it's fine sitting there right now. And he said uh, that when, just let him know when we're coming to get it. Yeah. Okay. And, and if I need to borrow some tools. Okay. So. Call your dad. Yeah, I was gonna call y'all and let y'all know what's going on, but I ain't got a signal in that neighborhood. No. But yeah, I was chilling out with uh, Jaja, 
was at his house for a bit. Then I went to go see Kathy, but Kathy wasn't home, and I was with Jaja. And then Jaja said, "Hey, he's home. You want to go see that truck that you're talking about that you want that I showed you?" And I was like, "Yeah." So and then okay, I told him, well, da -da 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 -da. so that's his story for today. Story time's over. No. Okay, story time's over. So, the whole point of this video, I got a package in the mail today from... <coughs> Lovely. I'm gone. Thank you. Will you at least say excuse me? No. Band kid. From Il Maquillage, New York. So, see, got this package in the mail today um, for a feel... Uh, uh, 14 day free trial. Um, so, we are going to. Try this out today. We're going to try this out today. And it's, it looks really good. Um, we're going to see what it looks like. I love the packaging, you guys. Um, let, me, let me show you what it looked like before I took it out of the box. So, um, it came like this on the inside. So, and then I just took the little pamphlet out. And I've got the foundation and the um, concealer is what I chose as my sample. So, um, if I like everything after the 14 day trial, then they'll charge me for everything I got. Um, as of right now, they only charged me $5 shipping, which is great. If I don't like it after the 14 days, I can send it back and it's on them. So we're going to see what this looks like. Good thing I've got scissors and everything. Um, right here so we're going to check this out I have it in this is woke up like this in 85 um, I was really trying to make sure that it kind of cooled off it's been sitting in yeah it's still a little warm it's been sitting in my mailbox um, for a little bit okay so it doesn't screw on it just pops on and off. It looks like it's going to be a pretty good match to my skin tone. I really, really love this packaging. It looks really, really good. Um, so that's that. And here's the um, BFF Perfecting Concealer. All of this is made in Italy is what it says. And um, let me see. We're going to try it out. And we're gonna do a tryout right now. So, um, give me two seconds. I'm gonna be right back. You guys can look at my wigs. What are you doing? Yeah, giggity. Hey, Peter, show me your backer. I'm still recording. Stop it. So, okay, I told you I was going to be right back. I'm going to get my light so I can have a better light to kind of see what I'm doing. Um, let me get some moisturizer and primer because this is like my everyday face that I do. Um, what do I need? What do I need? What do I need? Poof, what do you need? Poof, what do you need? Poof, what do you need? I need like you guys, I have like a million things on my vanity, vanity desk, whatever you want to call it. So I need. I need I 
a hair tie. Pull my hair back. What little hair I have. How's that? Because I want to make sure I get a full face foundation and I want to make sure I get this on good. Get it on good. Get it on good. And look, see my hair's I love my haircut. Um, and like I said, it looks like it's really full, um, but it's really not so. Um, this is that Pure Lease Blue Lotus Daily Moisturizer that I got the other day from my Ipsy bag. Why are you half naked in my room? I'm not half naked. My shirt's still on. It's just unbuttoned. And this is what I go through. Are you going to watch my makeup tutorial while I do it? No, and criticize? Oh my god. I'm kidding. I'm just here to eat a popsicle in front of you. Make you jealous. I'm not jealous. It's a push of popsicle. It tastes like crap, but it's cold. Then why didn't you just get ice cream? Did you try that lemon box ice cream yet? Mm -mm. Why not? Did you not hear what I told you the other day? There's only so much lemon you'll eat. It's like with peanuts. There's only so far I'm going to go with liking peanuts. Mm. I don't like it in food. I like it by itself. And peanut butter. Well, I figured since you like lemon cake, you might like, like lemon, like lemon ice cream. Pie. Lemon pie is good. I don't like it. I don't like See, this is the pie. kind of conversations we have. So, that's that. Let me get my primer. Where is my primer? Gucci flip flop. I don't. Stop. Stop. <laughs> Let's not do that today. Let's not do that today. <laughs> this is my... Again, it's a color and face tone up primer that I'm going to use. I don't know if you can see that. There you go. Before I try out this. Like, ooh, that's a bit much. Um, What is wrong with you? I don't know. I just like num nums. Do you just like num nums? Why aren't there something out there called num nums that they actually taste good? Um, num nums is anything that tastes good that you put in your belly. So it's like a snackle. A snackaroonie. No, a snackle. Yeah. Anything you get at, wait, what's the gas station? But yeah, I'm just really upset about the, uh... The truck? Mm -hmm. Mm hmm Oh, he played trombone, too. Hmm? He played trombone, too. Did he? Mm-hmm. That's cool. The reason why I got on that topic is because I said, I'm sorry, this bag smells. I had band today. Mm. And he said, I understand. My kids are in band. Da, 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 da. And then he asked what I played when uh, I was getting out. And I told him trombone euphonium. And then I told him the story about how for the last... My class is the last breed after this year. I'd march trombone and there's only three of us and then he said yeah I'd march uh no he said I played trombone did he march for your school I have uh, did you ask no and he is a much older gentleman so if he went to our school he went to the school before it was a bigger school uh he went and when it was like it was that the 80s school mm, before it was the school that it is now is yeah I'm pretty sure he was in the building before this building so the one over down I think, there. Possibly, possibly. If he did. Gotcha. He might just, I don't know. He just seems that kind of gentleman. Mm. Could be wrong. I didn't ask his age. He didn't really care to. This coverage seems pretty good. Um, I don't know if it's the right color, but I'm making it work. Do I seem a little pale to you? Shut up. Your bang kid. You don't want the answer to that question. No, I don't want the answer to that question. Because that makeup is not helping. I'm not helping you anymore. Lies. That is a lie. Lies. Nothing but pure lies. Because I will talk to you again. Like, right now. How did that even happen? That was kind of cool. I can't put it back down though. Okay. Bad. 
They might twist. I don't know. Oh, I just put way too much on right there. I'll fix all that. I hate when I do stuff like that, but it'll work it's out. Really good for autistic. So are you. So are you. So guess what I found out from this Riley? What? Uh, Kathy might have autism. You know how she's really loud? Mm-hmm. And she doesn't understand how loud she is. Like, it doesn't click in her head. Mm -hmm. That is a form of autism. Where you don't realize how loud you are. Mm -hmm. In retrospect to others. But she knows she's loud because everybody tells her that she's loud. But uh, she probably has autism. I can kind of see that. <laughs> okay. So I kind of... It might be a little light. That scared me. You did that to yourself. No, I didn't. But we'll see what I do with. There's only one popsicle left, one push pop. The rest of my makeup, what it looks like. You see? Blend all this stuff down. I mean, it's really buildable, so I kind of like that. I like the fact that it's buildable. I like the fact that it looks really natural-ish to my skin tone. Um, obviously, I really don't wear I try not to wear a lot of makeup during the day. I mean, seriously, my makeup for the day is tinted moisturizer and a little bit of concealer, and that's about it. So, if that tells you anything. But I'm really kind of digging this. I mean, I really am liking this color. Obviously, the test will be when we go outside and look at it. But. I mean, it looks really good. Um, I mean, and this is seriously my makeup routine right now. Is like what I'm doing. If I do a lot of makeup. I mean, this is pretty much it. 
I mean, this is it, kids. I don't do a lot. Add a little bit of color to my eyes. And this is a Luna eyeshadow in Juliet. This is what it looks like. So you guys can see that. That's it. It's just so I have a little bit of color. So you can kind of see my eyes. And get some brow definition going. Because, I mean, your girl's got brows. I really don't need to define them too much. I need to pluck them. But I don't need to define them too. Oh, shit. I don't need to define them too much. Hang on. I hate when I screw up my eyebrows. And that fixes that right there. And a little bit of mascara in Bellaterra Cosmetics because, I mean, I mean, this is, this is it, and this, this stuff is fabulous, I think. And there you go. And I just did a quick full face foundation with this, and I think it looks pretty snazzy. I just wish I had a lippy. That was a sheer, what is a sheer lippy? Here. And that's it. This is This is my makeup. This is pretty much an everyday look for me without a lot of without a lot of foundation and this looks good because this looks like it's just my regular skin I really love it um, yeah I think it looks good um what do you guys think let me know in the comments below what you think um, I think this will work we'll try it out for a couple more days and see what the wear on it is like and we'll go from there. I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye.